Alright, DuckTales 2. Scrooge looks kind of annoyed at them. He's going, what the, what the fuck are you waking me up for? I'm reading, bitches. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> and then look at his eyes there. Hmm? What? <laughs> it's like they found his porno collection or something. What the fuck are you holding that for? <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, I think he gets his eyes normal. I think it was perspective that made it just look like he was in complete shock and awe. They're looking for a map, basically. What kind of retarded uncle did you have? And now we're going on treasure map. Well, oh, spit on my spats. Who said this? The boys or Uncle Scrooge? Yeesh. As a DuckTales 2, as I already think I said. And he winks at me, I think. Yeah, there he goes. <laughs> Scrooge is hitting on me. <laughs> He's kind of perverted like that. I decided to do normal mode. Difficulty, whatever. But that was a mistake. I decided to pick this one. This is Niagara Falls. I can agree with Aqualong. I thought Long's Pad was supposed to be a bumbling dumbass. No, that probably almost sounded like him. I thought Long's Pad was supposed to be a bumbling dumbass. I think I was imitating him right there. Anyway, back to my regular narrative voice. Kill the frog. These frogs are annoying. They have the weirdest jumping pattern. And yeah, you can actually use your hook to uh, hook on to rings like that. And then I'm bouncing into the title screen, kind of, or the, uh, the top screen there. I'm breaking the laws of physics. Video game, I'm not really breaking the you know, laws of video game physics. This doesn't really like Niagara Falls either. Since when did frogs try to kill you? Well, at all, but since when do uh, frogs live on Niagara Falls? Or giant man eating flowers? For that matter. Alright, keep jumping. It actually takes a little longer, but not much longer. I mean, eight minutes is only so much longer. More frogs. I just couldn't get up there, so I had to go down here. But I want to talk to that Huey, Dewey, or Louie, whatever the fuck it is. But see, the jump just doesn't work. The only way you're going to get up there is if you bounce high enough. And the only way you can do that is by bouncing off a frog. Or... Dying. That doesn't work. Are they getting, like, hella dropped or something? Or maybe Launch Pad just dropping up on this giant plane, or this plane, or whatever it is. Alright. I haven't got nearly as much money as I had last time. Okay, never mind. There's not actually a box you can move, so you have to probably have that frog respawn, jump off of him, jump on the treasure chest in the box, and then talk to Shui, Dewey, or Louie, whoever it is. That's the problem. It'd be easier to tell if I was, uh... Um, I mean, you don't have to be a big fan of... DuckTales to figure out that there's distinction between their hats and outfits, you know, red, green, and blue. But this is in black and white, so it doesn't work as well. Let's get past this shit, because I don't want to... Uh, see how far I can get on easy mode, because, well, yeah. There's a reason I'm doing no plays, and there's a reason that, uh, you can pay me to do less plays. I would rather get paid for menial labor, principally. Doing fucking plumber business. I would rather do that than be played to do less plays, because, well, as much as I enjoy video games, I don't enjoy it that much. To the point where I would be, uh, actively training my memory to basically improve at games that will I only play for fun. Even the Pokemon games to some extent, although Pokemon games have, well, some of the more complex, as unwise, I don't know if that sound, yes, they have a very complex kind of structure, especially as they uh, progress. It just made you think more and more about how to build your team. Of course, yeah, then people will be arguing that basically turns uh, every kid into a Machiavellian. 
and uh, treat the Pokemon and by association humans as commodities. But, um, no, not me. And I have a philosophy of that where I um, only keep the Pokemon that I'm actually intending to use. Either as HM Pokemon. I mean, when you say slaves, of course, philosophically, you're just going to be able to criticize me. So, yeah, being a relatively good philosopher that I am, I still like to believe say these aren't HM slaves, they're uh, Pokemon solely for the HMs. Which means their function is based upon their um, rapid and uh, high level of utilization of HM moves. But I don't, I've been basically, I mean, especially down the portal, they basically make it so that in order to complete the Pokedex, all you have to do is see all these Pokemon. You don't have to catch all of them. If you want to make a living Pokedex, be my guest, but that's not what I intend to do. I mean, the Pokemon I have in my box, even now, I play about four hours into it, I have enough for almost an alternative team. Let's say my team is, uh, Grottle, Murkrow, uh, Luxio, Shellos for the four of them. That I should, well, there should be one more, shouldn't there? Eh, either way. But, yeah, I have alternatives like a Buizel, a. Well, I don't have a Pachadisu, but I really don't intend to have another electric type. I mean, if I do another team, I could do something easily. I could easily change it around to, say, actually having a pony type. I mean, I'm going to capture one, but I'm not going to having my final team that I'm going to get to leave four with, which would probably, which is going to include Bronzor, I'm not catch, and maybe something else. And I can't narrate much on this, because, well, look at me, I'm just fucking retarded, I can't, it took me so long to actually figure out how to do this, but once I get in, I'm just, you basically pull this thing over, Yeah, maybe I was actually confusing DuckTales 2 with DuckTales 1. Uh-oh, I found X-ray glasses. Now I can uh, look in uh, through Webby's clothes because you know Scrooge is a pedophile. But look what he was doing there—he was shitting on his face. He's a thecophiliac too, or a scatophile to be, or it's copperphiliac. Copperphiliac, if I'm not mistaken. What, what am I falling into? I'm drowning. Okay. I got almost eaten by that giant barracuda. There's, I don't know where the continue point is. It's another thing. And if the game is fair enough to give me, say, unlimited continues, or a decent continues system, anything like that, I could play it. But basically, I mean, if you're going to negotiate uh, no plays or let's play, so to speak, with me, then you have to, uh, well, negotiate with me through messages. Anyway, yeah, I got my ass kicked twice, and on easy difficulty, no less. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it, and...